Have you seen my sweatshirt? Sweatshirt? Yeah, the green one with the holes in it. In your dreams. Shane, wait. Uh, did you talk to Mom this morning? No, why? She didn't say anything to you? About? Hey, guys. Go. How hey, we doing? What? Is your mom around somewhere? No, coast is clear. Ah, uh, okay. Well, um, I was hoping to catch you before you uh, went off to school because I have some news. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Olivia and I were talking last night about uh, some things. We've been seeing a lot of each other, you know. We know. Uh, okay. Well, we were talking about the future. We were talking about what's going to happen. And um, we decided that Olivia is going to move in with me. Okay, well, somebody say something. What do you want us to say, Dad? Whatever you want. I know you both have an opinion on this. I want to hear it. Wasn't it a done deal? I mean, there's nothing we can do about it, right? Look, son, I'm not asking your permission. That's true. But I am interested in what you think. You want to know what I think? Yes, that's what I just said. You know, I think it stinks, and I hate it. Okay? We both know that this is what Dad wants, and now we just have to deal with it. Right, Dad? Mara, you don't have to just deal with it. I didn't come here to drop a bomb and leave. I, I, I want to know what you feel, what you're thinking. Why can't you just tell me that? Because Mom asked me not to, okay? Your mom already talked to you about this. No, me, not Shane. And don't worry about it. I mean, as long as you get what you want, everything's fine. No, everything's not fine, Mara. I didn't want you to find out it that It doesn't way. matter how I found out, Dad. It's happening. You're moving in with Olivia. That's just the way it is, right? And you're basically living with her now, anyway, so... Well, she is over there all the time. So, what's the difference? It's gonna be different, Mara. You know that. I just think that we need to talk about it. There's nothing to talk about. Everything's Mara, changed. Okay, 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 okay. I just don't know why your mom told you. Why didn't she wait for me? She knew I was going to be here. Why didn't she just wait for me to get here? Because she loves you, Dad. And she wants you to be happy. Hey guys, I know this hurts. I know it's difficult. I, I don't get it myself sometimes. I'm standing here with you right now and thinking, this is where I belong, here, with my kids. But not with Mom. Mara, I will always love your mother. Always. And she's right about something. She's right about the fact that no matter what happens between the two of us, we can't keep doing this to you. It's just, it's not fair. You know what, none of this is fair. Son, I just thought that if you knew what was going on, it would make it easier for you to deal with it. What now, you guys getting a divorce? No. We're not talking about divorce here. No, I, I didn't say yeah, anything Dad, about divorce. don't lie. Don't try and cover what you're thinking to, to spare us some kind of grief. Because moving in with Olivia... I mean, divorce is exactly where you and Mom are headed. We're not talking about divorce here, okay? We're talking about two adults living in an apartment together. That's all. Dad, you're the one that's always saying that you're going to be straight with us, that you're going to tell us the truth. Mara, I'm telling you the truth right now. No, you're denying it. Because you don't want to admit it to yourself. But if you'll think about it, You'll see that what I'm saying is true, and we won't have to play all these stupid games. I'm going to be late for school. Shane, just... Dad! Please, just... just there's just, nothing left to say, okay?
It's over. It's really over. Mara? Shane? Are you listening to me? Yeah, I'm listening to you. We're just having a different conversation, that's uh, all. Billy, that's why you brought me here to have this business talk about your brother? Now you're tuning in. That's not how this conversation No, okay? darling, I'm not going to take up much of your time. I just want to find out about your latest move. My latest move? Yeah. Get a little brother to move you into his house. No, Billy. I don't get Josh to do anything he doesn't want to do. Now, are we through with this? No, I'm just getting started. Great. You know, for somebody who's getting everything her way, you're just a mite bit testy. Joshua, what's wrong? I was just uh, talking to the kids about Olivia. Uh, actually, I told Mara yesterday that you and Olivia were going to live together. I know. Did she... Oh, <laughs> were they hard on you? I guess so, huh? Actually, they took it pretty well. I guess that's because you'd spoken to them already. I, I didn't do that to go behind your back. Yeah. It's just that Mara has been having a particularly difficult time with all this, and I wanted her to be prepared. That's, that's all. She was prepared. I was not. We need to talk. <laughs> We're talking. I mean, we need to really talk, Reva. It's just, uh, it's just hard for me to say what I'm about to say, especially standing here in this house. Well, whatever you have to say, why don't you just say it? It's time for us to talk about getting a divorce. Wow. <laughs> I don't have a quickie little comeback for that. We both knew this was coming, Riva. It's uh, best for the kids, I yeah. think. Best for the kids. <laughs> I don't know how any of this could be best for the kids. I mean, is it best for Mara? Is it best for Shane? <sighs> I, I meant that we've already been apart for a while. And you're moving in with Olivia. You're right. I mean, I, I knew that this day was coming. It's just that, you know, the word divorce... Uh, it's, you know, a word that describes the end of something that was so beautiful that we created together, you know, family and home. Something we worked so hard to get back to. And now it's just gone. Hey, Bill. Hey. Hi. What's going on? You, uh, you sounded kind of desperate on the phone. I'm beyond desperate. Thank you so much for meeting me. I, I, I don't have anyone to talk to. Well, I'm, I'm here. Talk to me. What's, what is it? Fine. I'll talk to you. I just, I don't want to talk to her. Olivia? Yeah. She's still seeing your dad, I guess. Seeing him sleeping with him. Now she's gonna live with him. She's ruining everything, Bill. Everything. So I guess there's really nothing left to say, is there? I guess not. So what's the next step? Um, we... Talk to a lawyer, I suppose. Yeah. 
Oh, boy, that could be a little interesting, seeing as we both have the same lawyer, <laughs> Ross. <laughs> well, <laughs> you you can use him. I'll, I'll find somebody else. Thanks, thanks. It's, I mean, it's not like we have a whole lot to, you know, figure out. We're not fighting over who gets the kids. That's, that's true. It's, it's sort of funny, uh, isn't it? Uh, here we are in the middle of the biggest crisis of our lives, and, and we don't have anything to fight about. <laughs> Maybe we should divorce more often. <laughs>